have here is a diagram of a PC board. These little squares right here represent the soldered contact points that are holding the relay onto the board. This is the power coming into the coil. If you have power to the coil, that's what you're going to want to know on a PLC, if you're testing a PLC. So in order to make the test with a mag probe, instead of unsoldering all the contacts and pulling the relay off and going through all kinds of, you know, drastic measures in order to do this, with a mag probe, you just hold the mag probe up to the coil and instantly, the minute that it detects the magnetic field around the coil, you know that you have voltage, current, and continuity. Now, if the relay is not doing its job at this point, then you know you have a problem with the contact points. Now, if you're troubleshooting a PLC, this is really good too. PLC is second sending a signal to some critical relays that are not doing their job, and you want to find out if it's actually sending the signal. You just hold the mag probe up to the relay, and instantly you know that you got a signal from the PLC. If you hold the mag probe up to this coil while the relay is supposed to be energized and there's nothing, that means that there's something wrong here. You've got an electrical problem. Now, if you're an auto mechanic, you can use your imagination because there's relays all over a car. Look at that. Bam. Just like that, you know that you have isolated a mechanical from electrical problem in seconds. It's that simple. He just turned on the relay and it's working. This is on a PC board. Can I turn it off? He's going to turn the furnace on. Watch what happens with the mag probe. There it goes. It's energized. That's simple.